if you're new to my channel, my name is Julianne and I'm from Canada. I am a self-proclaimed, multi-passionate person and I like making vlogs about my business journey and I'm just here to honestly document what I do in a day as so that later on I can look back and reflect on and be proud of the different things I've created and I'd love to share it here on YouTube so that hopefully I can inspire other people who want to live a bit more of an unconventional life and show you how it can be done. Alright, so this morning was pretty fun because I had to go get a COVID test because on Wednesday I'll be working as a background actor and we need to get COVID tests done for most of the shows. So that was really nice because I get paid to do a COVID test, so that's always great. Okay, so something kind of unexpected but very exciting happened. So I've been expecting this um, package like from my supplier for my cups and they arrived today. So I'm gonna, so there was like, there's like a really big truck out by my house. So we're just gonna open the garage door and move our car and let them in. And I'll just, sorry, my garage is super messy, but yay. So we just moved these boxes to our garage and I have to go and teach a class so I have to rearrange those later but I'm still happy. I'm just taking a little break because this morning was so chaotic, way more chaotic than I expected. So my mom and I, we made some brown sugar matcha milk tea. And I made this vlog. I was like trying to film myself like making it, but then I didn't press play. So it's okay, next time. So we've been decluttering these days. So we're just gonna head to Valley Village and the local eco center to recycle some of our old stuff. And yeah, let's go. So this is probably like our third time in the past week of going to Valley Village and the Eco Center. So that just shows you how much stuff we've accumulated over the years. But it's okay, it's never too late to declutter. It's important to get rid of old things and new opportunities and new things can come into your life. So yeah, let's get rid of all of this stuff. All right, so we got rid of all of our stuff. We hit the Eco Center and Value Village and now we're on the way back home. And my mom was just saying that she feels so much lighter and happier and it's probably because we got rid of all our stuff. So yeah, tip if you want to feel happier, just go declutter and donate your stuff.
Okay, so right now today, I think I definitely overestimated what I can get done. So I'm just going to focus on checking my emails and going through all my emails and trying to respond to everyone, um, like various inquiries and whatnot. A big thing with entrepreneurship is that there is kind of like an endless bucket of things to do. So if I don't set certain boundaries and parameters of what is considered a success for me, then it's really easy for me to feel like, oh, I kind of failed in a day or I feel like, oh, I didn't ac accomplish anything. So by setting like really clear boundaries and really like writing out, oh, what, what are the things that I actually did today? Um, it really helps me just really remember that, okay, I actually did stuff even though I have a long list of other things I still have to get done. Just reminding myself that you only have a certain number of hours in a day. So today, my thing is emails. Let's do this. Okay, I'm doing a little impromptu crochet session because I have to send out an order today. So I'm just gonna quickly make a few, a couple of hearts. It shouldn't take me more than like 15 minutes. So yeah, a little intermission from checking my emails. So two hearts and I finished that in six minutes. So I just went through a bunch of my emails and now I'm gonna go teach a class and then have dinner, which is takeout from my favorite donair place. And then I'm teaching another class, going to the gym, and then, yeah, calling my friends. Yeah, let's stay consistent. 